The Many Mysteries of Bonnie the Cat Bonnie the Cat washed and stretched and slept. She never seemed to do much at all until she disappeared up the path and around the bend for hours on end. Max wanted to know, where did Bonnie go? He tried to follow, but was always just a little bit too slow. Max thought he heard the cicadas call for Bonnie to play ball. But when he leapt over the fence to inspect, there was nothing there but a tatty old net. He thought he spied Bonnie playing cards in the yard with the mice, and why not? For they always seemed so nice. But when he crawled into a nook for a closer look, he was too late. Only the eight of spades remained. Down at the beach, Max thought, That's Bonnie in her tog swimming with the dogs. But on closer inspection of that section of sea, there was nothing there but some soggy old logs. One moonlit night, Max heard music wafting to his room and thought, This is it! Bonnie's having drinks with the skinks! With a yawn he went down to the lawn, but there was only the echo of a single gecko's call. And so it was. Max never found out where Bonnie went, but she always came back content. And best of all, always playful. Until she washed and stretched and slept once more.